the apprentice challenge for our students, I think, is a really important opportunity for them not to just develop the, uh, the kind of business skills, but to build their self-confidence, to build their self-esteem. Their ideas and their creativity can be translated into a practical um, aspect. Oh my God, I got a spot! That's why you need Target, because it always hits a spot. Everyone has black heads and that's when the pool is clogged but the top is open. It then turns into a pimple which is when you have a damaged pore with dead skin as well as live skin. If you mess around with it, it can turn into a cyst which is when you have a clogged pore and a deep opening. To apply the product, you massage it onto your hand until it heats up. When applying the product on the face, you gently massage onto the area until skin warms up. The reason why we rub the skin until it heats up is for the blood to come to the surface and to make the product work. We have chosen to sell our product in a keyring or a charm. It's because it's discreet and you can always have it with you, wherever you are. We Target as a group have chosen CTM to manufacture anti-blemish balm as they have had over 30 years experience in skincare products. Through our research we found out that our target market's main concern was if the product worked, if it was eco-friendly and the pricing. Target decided to use organic dyes for our name and logo on our packaging. Throughout Target's investigation on the prices of our ingredients and packaging, our total costs ranged from £3.65 to £4.34. However, one of our main costs were the glass refills of £5.76. Although there were great variations in the different prices, Target decided to sell the cost of sales to the retailer for £8, which will allow the retailer to sell to the consumers for £16. As Target's aim is to sell in upmarket stores, we're willing to give John Lewis pure exclusivity for six months if they're able to take 20,000 units off our hands. This will enable them to have 625 units in each of their 32 stores. We have decided to distribute our product in upmarket retail outlets such as Fennec, Space and K and the House of Fraser. Some features that we would like to include in our advert are a name, logo and slogan, some humour and some style. The number of ways to promote ourselves to our target market, we decided to use billboards, TV adverts, radio adverts, magazines, leaflets and social networks. Target is planning to extend the product line into the mill market, which would include key rings such as football, rugby ball and boxing gloves. <laughs> Target has chosen great ingredients. Glycerol improves the texture of the skin. Renuka honey, it's antibacterial and will prevent the spot from returning. Witch hazel, which is a strong antioxidant, which helps prevent swelling and fights acne. There's also petrolatum, which helps to smooth the skin. Bentonite, it is cleansing clay used to treat acne. Pure borage oil gets rid of acne and eczema. There is calamine, which relieves itching and inflammation. And jojoba oil, which is good for the skin and stress. Cetereal, which smooths down the skin. Coconut oil, it gets rid of acne, eczema, psoriasis and irritation. Caprylic, which thickens the product and shows loss of water. And the final ingredient is pure vitamin E, which smooths and soothes and lightens acne and marks fine lines. introduce myself. My name's Sharon Evans and I work as a, co a commercial relationship manager for NatWest. And I'm here to try and help you today in respect of your pitch to John Lewis later on this afternoon. So what's given you this idea to, to, to pitch this product? Where's this idea come from? We basically thought about what is um, people's concerns really. Right. And we just thought um, spots are, you know, mainly people's <laughs> concerns. <laughs> <laughs> that you've got the, the sort of quirky side of it where you're going to be able to, to sell this in charms or keywords. Talk, talk me through that. We thought we need something discreet that or when you're feeling it, someone will be like, oh here's a spot cream. Like yeah. something that is like secret to you. So we thought, oh, what could be secret? And what's in fashion at the moment? So you've got the sustainable angle as well as the quirky angle with the charms mm. as well as your, yeah. your your actual product. What's really important I guess as a starting point is the management team. All the management says good luck this afternoon. <laughs> 
Thank, Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hi, I'm Jason, um, we're at you. I'm the um, beauty buyer for John Lewis. And Sue Marshall, the assistant buyer for beauty. Hello. So over to you. Today we're going to talk to you about our product Target. From our beauty therapy and our client consultations, we came to the conclusion that people are most concerned about their spots. If you'd like to come and have a look at our yeah, that was yeah. <laughs> Well, this is all the anatomy of the skin and yeah. why we get spots and how you can prevent them. And this is how we came up with our logo and our slogan and how we designed it. And the different so you designed that, um, the, the logo Yeah, well. we designed yeah. the logo oh. as well. Well, we've actually decided for our, our product to be in small charms or that even key things. charms. Tell us a bit more about that, the, um, the idea there. But we came up with this idea because we thought they're small and they're discreet and no one really wants to show that they have a spot bar. And so the costs and the retails that you propose, that, that's based on the, the sort of packaging you're looking at here. Okay. Did you consider maybe having your retail a little higher? Bear in mind you said that we're selling from 16 to 32 pounds. Um, and almost the customers, as you said, is almost buying a piece of jewellery and a product yeah. that, that, that works. Do you think maybe you could actually even potentially charge more? We could charge more, but most of your products are like 16 to 30, range between 16 and 30. Because we're a new market entering the actual whole market on a yeah. so we thought that we would advise to start off at a lower well, price yeah. and then increase. You have to watch with the container about contamination. You know, the sealing, does it matter? How they shut? Yeah, they're sealed enough because they lock. Yeah, they're yeah. so on. Open. Yeah, because these are only prototypes, but the actual ones will actually yeah. stick yeah. 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 down. So how quickly does it work? Wow, well, it, it works. It works. Away, really. Yeah, from the minute you put it on, because you're you put it on basically when you feel the spot, the spot coming. Come so it does so it. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. it actually prevents the spot from actually coming out onto the surface of the skin. So it yeah. actually works from the minute you put it on. Well, I think, I think it's a really well, very, very well researched Search, yes. um, subject. You've clearly done a hell of a lot of work behind it. We certainly do well um, in the spot. It's an interesting, different product, and I think it's very, very thoroughly presented, so well done. Yeah, very well done. Thank you. I think at the beginning, when, we, when, John, when the members from John Lewis walked in, I felt a bit nerve wracked I think we're going to win the Breaking the Mold competition because we've given a good pitch, we've got a good product, and we're just good. We've been ourselves all the way through yeah. and had fun. We're hoping to get a male and female celebrity to use their faces with Target for the female and male one. We so. recently had an interview with someone from Chelsea Football um, Club and they said that um, they think that our product is really good. I'm Tiana. I'm Chelsea. And we're from Cocktail School. We've learnt uh, the business side of it. The fun part on working on this project has been obviously meeting new people that we wouldn't necessarily talk to. If we win the competition, uh, we're going to give Princess Anne this locket, which is in a crown, and it would have the product in it. Hi, I'm Mercy. Hey, I'm Divya. Hi, I'm Sasha. This project has taught me to work with different people from different backgrounds. For me, this has been a really great experience as we've all come from different departments. Reaching the finals this Apprentice Challenge has made the school feel very proud as they feel that we can contribute positively towards the school's community. We're really nervous about going to the final on the 14th. It's because our team's never really had to do this kind of thing before, like standing in front of 400 people. It's also really exciting though because we get to tell others about something we've created. Target always hit the spot!